Yes, sir. We got a banger, man. We got a banger. This one right here, man. Classic. Finally being able to add this to the collection. This is one that I've wanted for a very long time. And I'm glad 2024, I'm able to add this one to the collection. Let's get this thing started. Yeah! Uh, 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 yeah. It's a couple Jordan 1 retros and they gotta be in your collection You just collect them, you never gon' step in I can respect it, but that ain't for me I got a lace so deep, let's see me threes And throw a little fit together Get on the go, L, play some bid And hopefully I can just hit forever I'm from the bottom, I don't wanna ride But this part of our culture, you gotta be fly Ride flowing with the Air Forces Put that shit on to the day that I die Nikes over Adidas What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, the Retro Wiz Kid, the Shoeologist, and y'all rocking with your boy in the Sneaker Dungeon, y'all. Hope everyone's having a great day today. Today, we taking a look at one of my favorite sneakers to release this year so far, you know, for the month of March. It has not been too crazy, I feel like, this year. You know, probably the sneaker that had the biggest hype would probably be the Air Jordan 4 Bread Reimagine that came out. And I mean, for me, you know, I like messing with New Balance, so, you know, New Balance has some crazy heat come out, you know, so for me, this one right here you know when it comes to nike this was one that i was really looking forward to picking up now this was a woman's exclusive release and yesterday we actually did have a sneaker well actually it'll be today because i'm filming this video on air max day but i'll probably drop it either on wednesday or thursday you guys will see this video so whichever day it was man you know these dropped on the 22nd of March, but I got these on Air Max Day, so what a great release to get in the mail. I also got another one that came in too, but enough of the talking, man. We're gonna go ahead and pop this lid, man. We ain't gonna even use the knife. We're gonna use straight up ripping, you feel me? So really excited to see these now this was again as i say a women's release and on air max day which is today we actually had the air max day big bubble release with that boat colorway <laughs> yes lord them things big fuego you know you know complimenting the pair that came out with the og red pair that came out and they had the same type of effect a long time ago this is just a nice touch i mean a lot of people would look at the air max one and say you know they mess with the red and white pair over this pair. But if you guys are new to the channel, you guys don't know when it comes to that Royal colorway, man. I love Royal on anything, man, on anything. And especially on this pair right here. It was one point in time that I was willing to pay like three, $400 for this sneaker, y'all. But I'm glad I didn't and I was patient because I already know history will repeat itself and we'll get it back. So right here, just like last year, we have this red, black, and see-through box with a little bit of white, man. And you guys can see the big bubble effect on these and everything like that. Of course, you got that see-through right there. Now, the official name and colorway of these, Nike Air Max 186 OG, white, royal, blue. Now, I did get these in a women's size 12 and a half, which is a men's size 11. Y'all already know the vibes. Went true to size when it came to these right here. Now, let's go ahead and pop the lid and let's check these bad boys out. Nothing crazy. Tissue paper looking just like the tissue paper from last year. And the pair that we got in the white and red. Woo! Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, y'all. Y'all see them, man. Y'all see them, man. Woo! <laughs> yes, Lord. Hold up, man. Hold up, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. These things have officially been smell test approved. By your boy, the Retro Wiz Kid. Let's get these things up out the box. And we in there. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, y'all. I'm talking about Big Fuego, y'all. I'm going to keep it real with y'all, man. These will probably go down in my top 10. If it's not this pair, it might be the Volt pair. But I probably will say that this pair might be my favorite pair to release. Just because, you know, you're getting that crazy classic look to these. And, you know, the Volt pair is a plus. With having the 326 on there and just being the Volt midsole. But still being the same type of sneaker, man. Everything about this shoe right here, I just think it's super fuego, man. We're going to turn the camera around, get some nice little close-ups on these bad boys. And we're gonna throw these bad boys on feet for y'all as well. Yay! All right, y'all. So this one right here, you know, Air Max Day coming up. These releasing on March 22nd. Suggest so to retail $150, man. And I must tell you right now that this one right here, being a woman's release only, was kind of crazy for this Nike Air Max 86 Royal Blue. Now, when we talk about this one right here, this has been one that we have not seen in its true form. This one being more so closer to the 1986 release of the Big Bubble. And I feel like, you know, with the midsole 
stretch imparting a much higher profile on the shoe as a whole. This marks the first release since 2017. And comparing that pair, the color choices on this one are also a little bit more vintage when you come in with the blue that you have on this one, as well as the gray that we have on this one. Now you do have mesh on this sneaker with a nice little combination. I love how up on the upper you do have like that shiny type vibe to it. You do have the classic old school sizing right there. Now this does say 12 and a half because this is a women's sizing, but this is a men's 11. Now when you look at the sneaker, man, I must say that big bubble does give it some dope definition. Nike Air Brandon on the inside, white sock liner. You cannot go wrong with this one right here. Here's another look at the inside of the sneaker right there for the insole. Y'all let me know y'all's thoughts and opinions. For me, this was definitely a must grab. Let's go ahead and throw these bad boys on feet. Get it! A nigga a regular goofy. I give her like 10 in the Gucci. She give me a wig and a coochie. I'm a dog, she in love with a poochie. She know that my feeling be choosy. After I hit her, I tell her to lose me. She see my life and she think it's a movie. This a SRT boy, we gon' get lost. I just pray to Jesus I don't get cross. Put that pack off in my hand and it's gon' get off. Let them niggas try and play the Glock on miss. Y'all, them niggas wanna see my demon. Hop out quick, my spin this evening. We outside right now, we linkin'. I won't blink till I catch them sleep. I go hand me if you say we beef it. Two cups and little nigga, I'm leaning. I promise won't share our secrets. Perky pill, it got me geeky. Niggas change any bitch, you get irky. Full of pain, so I pop me a perky. Still ain't found me no coochie, that's worth it. I remember when you bitches were curvy. Now we flying in the forums like birdies. She gon' whip it like she Aisha Curry. We don't spin it, we just giving them birds. My boy is shooting 30 for 30. That bitch ain't no regular groupie. Her nigga a regular goofy. I give it like 10 in the Gucci. She give me a wig and a coochie. I'm a dog, she in love with a poochie. She know that my feeling be choosy. After I hit her, I tell her to lose me. She see my life and she think it's a movie. This a SRT boy, we gon' get lost. I just pray to Jesus I don't get crossed. Put that pack off in my hand and it's gon' get off. Let them niggas try and play this block, won't miss y'all. enjoyed the full detail review over the nike air max 186 og in this royal colorway definitely a vibe i feel like for all my og heads out there that love sneakers and you know you you got a little bit of knowledge about history this one right here was a must cop for you, man. You know what I'm saying? Some people might have passed on them because they just don't mess with Air Max. But it's certain Air Max I feel like every every sneaker head, head should have inside their collection. 96s, 95s, 98s. You know what I'm saying? You got to have some type of Vapor Max. I feel like when it comes to Air Max, you got to at least give a spin with one of the silhouettes at least one time and have it in your collection. Now, y'all already know, your boy had to have this pair to go with this pair right here. University red pair that came out last year. Here, man we have them right here so let me know right now in the comment section the battle of the air max 186 og big bubble and these actually came out in a golf as well what are y'all rocking with y'all rocking with that royal are y'all messing with that red pair man or is y'all messing with this red pair man i ain't gonna hold you man when it comes to this university red these joints is clean man but i gotta tell y'all nothing beats this right here in my personal little opinion but it is your boy the retro whiz kid y'all stay tuned to the channel y'all already know how we rock man i will spin the pictures for you guys i do have another banger coming for you guys one that i've been waiting for since december finally got them in i actually rocked them today so i already unboxed them but i'm gonna give you guys my thoughts and opinions over them and uh yeah man y'all stay tuned to the channel for that but peace love in laguna beach and we out this thing Get it! It's a couple Jordan 1 retros and they gotta be in your collection. You just collect them, you never go step in. I can respect it, but that ain't for me. I gotta lay so deep, let's see me threes and throw a little fit together. Get on the go, L, place a bid, and hopefully I can just hit forever.